Hello, this is the Morning Gardener, and I'm in my little greenhouse here. This is uh, me just making a small uh, batch of, uh, of uh, you know, seed starter. And really, this right here is compost. It's actually cow manure, composted cow manure. And then we got the uh, perlite and vermiculite, the, the, the thick, big, burly kind. Not the real powder kind, the thick kind. <coughs> Excuse me, it's a little dusty in here with this stuff I'm spilling in here. But here's what's going on. Um, I'm mixing a little up. It's, it's a lot of rain outside, 22 degrees a day. So I'm mixing it up, getting a couple, uh, you know, starts for all my uh, early gardening this year. That's what I'm going to do. And so I'm just showing you this because I'm going to mix it up. This, All this here probably costs. 20 cents maybe not that much and 30 seconds later it's mixed and it looks just as good as the stuff in the bags in the store in fact it looks better this is how you do it like I said might be 20 cents worth and it's enough here to fill a good sized pot or a bunch of bunch of pots to start seeds seedlings all right well I'm back morning garden and look at this I haven't put a dent in this uh, really and I got all my uh, plants uh, planted in now let me tell you about what I did here these are my crops for this the spring and summer and uh, these are loaded with seeds okay so I didn't do like some people do one and two seeds three seeds I, I don't care I want them to grow I want as many as I can put in there whatever survives survive whatever doesn't I work hard every day and I can furnish more seeds if I need to buy more seeds but uh, or you know use some of my ones that I saved and right now you got peppers, you got banana peppers, you got bell peppers, um, you got cantaloupe, you got pel uh, peppers here, you got tomatoes, you got the giant peppers, you got rosemary, you got everything in here. So when they start growing, I'll then move them out, separate them and that sort of thing. These right here have a bit of, I moved them off of the heat today and they immediately started wilting. And so I put them back on the heat and and uh, these right here real slow germination these are supposed to be kale really slow germination I'll find out what's going on um, but the, the collard greens took off no problem at all they just took off I put them in the soil matter of fact I just held them over the soil and they started growing okay well maybe not that well but you know what I'm saying they grew well these are the um, spinach because I like to eat spinach and <clears throat> these were put in here some of you are seeing tomorrow's date on there yes it is tomorrow's date but I made a mistake and I just kept going with it because I'm not going to worry about that because I know it's just a day and whatever survives survives these are my seeds and I want all of you to get started as soon as possible because this is the time to do it is to get it done early get it in so when here in Maryland we got a, we have a slow growing season what we mean what I mean by that is that if you plant in May time you plant your seeds your plants get up big enough it'll start getting cold and it'll be time for you to lose everything you you worked and dreamed about all um, of the uh, whole year for your garden but these here these are early starts here now they haven't been watered uh, there's a reason why I haven't watered them yet I'll think of one, but right now this is moist uh, that I was working with here. This was moist, so I'm not going to water them right now. Uh, I, I want this mix to get up to temperature, and I got a heat mat under everything, and, uh, and we're going to just go with that and just do the best we can. That's all we can do, right? So this is the Morning Gardener, and I'm looking forward to seeing some of your videos. I'm still putting videos up, and I'm getting ready to do the show thing. 
and I want you to all of you to you know stop by and just say hello or just give some information or some uh, some helpful tips that would help other people as well as myself and we're gonna work together and try to get a decent garden off this year this is the morning gardener I think I just got a hook there real quick before I go this is my high dome <clears throat> excuse me this is my high dome and I found it online just in case any of you you know see this and like it or if you know what one is in the department stores uh, just put a uh, message down there and let everybody know because these high domes are really really nice they allow you to grow your plants a little bigger and uh, in, in, in the indoors while you're still dealing with the cold weather got my little thermometer back here and uh, let's see what we got here temperature wise looks like it's down near 40 no women uh, 45 it looks like 45 degrees in here okay this is the morning gardener showing you one more good look because I love this stuff I love this stuff here look at that beautiful to me that's beauty to see things grow beautiful